kiss for you. Bismillah Rahman Rahim. Welcome to my another video on Android app development and so guys in this video I am going to teach you how you can apply the frames in your images using Android Studio. Alright guys so there are multiple ways of uh, putting the frames into your images. Uh, you can also do that by using the OpenCV library but in this video I am uh, I am going to teach you how you can do that in basic java using the basic java library okay so let's get started so first of all i want to show you what i will teach you and then we can start and okay so here you can see i have this app and if i select a photo so let's say if i select this image all right and there are you can see there these are all the frames so if i press this so you can see the frames have been applied to this image then if I want to change the frame so you can see uh, I can apply multiple frames to my images all right and also if you want the source code so you can uh, send me a message and I will give you but uh, that won't be free so okay so here you can see I have these multiple frames so let's get started so here uh, this activity is in the uh, is the edit uh, new edit activity and we are fetching the image from our main activity to this uh, new edit activity okay then here what i am going to do first of all i want to show you that here we have this recycler view here and if we click on any item of the recycler view so we fetch all these frames from the assets okay so you can see here i have the stickers of type 1 then we have the type 3 type 4 and type 5 and similarly all these okay so now what i will show you here uh, i have this uh, i am doing this and i am applying all the frames in the async task class so yes okay so whenever the user will click on any frame so here you can see it is we are in the stickers adapter and there if when the user clicks on any frame so we fetch the drawable pro of that index and then we uh, send the drawable and the adapter position okay to this add sticker uh, method that add sticker method is in the new edit activity all right and here we have uh, I have a check here that if the if a frame is selected then do this if the frame is not selected I mean if any other sticker is selected so we need to add the sticker so we don't we, we will not go here we will just be fetching all and executing this code so here you can see we have this frame uh, we converted the drivable to our bitmap and frame bitmap is our here and we copied this uh, frame bitmap to another bitmap that is frame bitmap new and we do that with this configuration argb double eight double eight all right and then we have this original image and you can see we copy from this image bitmap to our original and after this we just uh, execute this async task class and this is the syntax of execu executing this class so if we go to this class and we are only sending this position and we have these two things frame bitmap new i mean this will be the frame and this one will be the original image so here inside this uh, async task so we can just remove this own pre execute method and inside this own uh, i mean do in background method we have a, a method draw frame and we are only passing the parameters over to it so in this case it will be one two three or four or five okay whatever index we are accessing the frame from so here inside this uh, draw frame uh, method we here we are checking if the original is not equal to null and i think i should remove that because it is not 
that important okay so now we have this offset so here you can see i we have this private class at offset and this determines the offset of of the selected frame okay so basically it uh, determines the offset and here it has the width and height so we have this constructor which has this uh, which takes the width and height and then we are just having this okay so basically this is a model class of offset so what we are going to do with this offset so here you can see we can say offset into position so this method gets the the offset and there you can see we have the point x and point y then we have width of and width this one and then here inside our uh, while loop we are checking if the temperature uh, if the temp pixel um, are point x and then temp dot get height divided by 2 uh, is not equal to 0 then we just increment our width and we increment the point pixel of x axis alright similarly for the y axis here and then we just return our offset and after this offset we are we have this uh, width and height of our of the offset and then we have the original bitmap then we have the temporary bitmap and then we just uh, have we just i mean uh, scale it down and there you can see we scale the width and height of the bitmap and then uh, okay let me just remove it and then we have we are we have now the width and height of the temporary and this is the way of uh, I mean doing all these things and applying the filter here alright and then here inside this frame and after this uh, this on post execute method we are just re uh, returning this image view dot set image bitmap why is there any why is the error here okay so i guess that is enough and if you want the the source code so i can provide you you just need to message me i will upload the link in the video description all right guys if you like the video please like share and subscribe